What's the lowdown on the after party holdout? I'm ready to throw down. Is it gonna be the best night ever or what? Suppose Perhaps. so. Whatever is the matter, girls? I thought you were excited for the soiree. We were. We even put together a super special slideshow of all the great memories we made while doing the play. But Mr. Cranky Doodle says parties are not an appropriate appropriation of his expensive projector. Maybe one of us can turn that heart of coal into a diamond. If he's going to be stubborn about it, so can we. Hey there, Mr. Cranky Doodle. I heard you won't let us borrow your projector for our party. You heard right. Ooh, she's gonna have a good old-fashioned stubborn off. <gasps> I'm asking nice. The answer's no. Not leaving without it. You're gonna be here a while. Fine by me. Talking overnight. Got a sleeping bag. Floor's not comfortable. Air mattress, too. You'll hyperventilate. Got an air pump. Won't let you plug it in. Foot powered. You'll get a cramp. Eat bananas for potassium. They're not in season. You're right. I can admit when I'm beat. Ha! <laughs> Great party, you guys. Yeah, good times. Oh, oh my God! God. Thanks for finding my flashlight. I've missed this. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you worry, girls. In the fashion industry, there is no room for compromise, and I happen to be an excellent negotiator. Good evening, Mr. Cranky Doodle. Uh, hello, Rarity. I am here representing the Cutie Mark Crusaders. I understand you are denying them the use of a projector. Yes, my projector. Uh, let the record show that Mr. Cranky Doodle has identified the projector in question. So, if I am understanding you correctly, this is your projector. Yes. And you take it home with you when the school day ends. Well, no, I can't do that. Mm, that's right. You can't do that, can you? In fact, this projector cannot leave the school premises because it isn't your projector at all. It is the property of Canterlot High School, a public school funded by hard-working taxpayers such as Applejack and myself. So technically, is this not the taxpayer's projector? My projector, Applejack's projector! Therefore, did you not lie under oath when you identified it as your own? I didn't take an oath. You're out of order! This whole projector situation is out of order! I'm confiscating it as evidence. Wait! It's expensive, and it could be damaged if not cared for properly. Also, I pay taxes, too. You're saying you'd feel more comfortable if someone were there to supervise it? <laughs> we did it! Oh, delighted we could reach a settlement. In exchange for the projector, he could attend the party to supervise said projector. <laughs> Wrong. Wrong. Right, but... Mr. Cranky Doodle, come quick! There's a full-blown math emergency backstage! A math emergency? Sweetie Drop's fixing to take the square root of negative one! It's worse than I could have imagined. I say I and imagined because... a little coaching. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Where are those girls anyway? Uh, we gotta get back to... Uh, 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 here's where the problem really shifts into high gear. Take that solution and plug it into this function and the square root of the sum of the second final number. 